Good morning, everyone. Happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Check out the view today. Check out the view. Who's getting on? Who's coming out to play this morning? We ride at dawn. 365 live. Someone's got to be awake out there. Let's go. We're burning daylight. Look at that sunrise. Who's out there today? Good morning, good morning. What's up, Facebook world? Coming to you live from Hempstead Lake State Park. We ride at dawn. This is day uh, 51, I think we're up to now. 51 days in a row, we're riding at dawn, 6 a.m. And uh, we're on the journey to 365. And uh, for those of you joining us, this is where we're at today. So this is Hempstead Lake State Park. Long Island, New York, not too far from New York City. Those are my friends uh, out of the area that I tagged on here. Good morning. So, Wednesday edition, we ride at dawn. And we're coming to you from the lake. And uh, we got a little message for you today. Um, as you guys know, I like to... Uh, Throw on my earbuds and uh, throw on uh, the podcast shuffle and see what shows up. And this morning, uh, Ryan Steumann's always in the mix. Uh, but then uh, the Make Good Choices podcast, Mark Zalinoff, uh, with his uh, podcast with Drew Lane, showed up in the mix. And uh, there's a common theme that's kind of out there um, that I think is important. Um, the theme was... Uh, are you being true to yourself? Are you being real and are being are you being you? Um, a lot of us um, are trying to be someone that we're not. Um, we're trying to put out an image um, that's not real. We're trying to uh, fake it till we make it. Um, and we're not being real with ourselves. We're not being honest with ourselves. Um, you know, like Ryan said, um, you know, when he started doing his... Uh, his coaching and whatnot, he was different. He didn't have the suit and tie on. He was real. He had tattoos. He wore a sweatshirt. Uh, he didn't fit the mold. And uh, in the beginning, it was rough. But now he's setting the tone and, and creating the mold. Um, and then we, Mark jumps on with Drew, and they start talking about how it's you got to be real. you got to be real. Um, we all have struggles in life. We all have stuff we're going through. And uh, I think it's important to share those struggles with the world rather than... Uh, brush over those struggles and um, just be real because we're helping other people that are going through similar struggles. Um, a lot of people are faking it that uh, everything's fine and it's not. Um, we know everyone's got issues going on in their lives. It's not this Facebook world where everything looks uh, looks like this. You know, most people put this out all the time, but you won't see behind the scenes. You'll see the, uh, the pretty pictures. You'll see all the fun stuff. But you won't see the uh, the agony and the depression and all the other stuff behind the scenes. Um, so the message is: uh, question yourself. Are you being real with yourself? Uh, a lot of people. Um, I encourage people to go live on Facebook, uh, my team members, um, because uh, you know what? If you don't know me personally, by me going live, you're gonna learn a little bit about me. You're gonna learn who I am. Uh, maybe at some point you'll do business with me. Um, maybe not. Maybe I can help you. Um, you know, I do a little bit of coaching. Um, obviously I sell real estate. Um, I have investment properties. Um, I have a network of people across the country to do basically anything you need done in life. I have someone, a friend that I can refer to you. Uh, I consider myself a connector. Um, I like to help people. I like to help people make their lives better. Um, on this journey, uh, a lot of you guys know, I talk about this group Apex down in Texas. And one of the things I've learned from this group is how real everyone is and how important it is <clears throat> to share your struggles and your journeys. Um, I just did a podcast with my friend Tom Keenan uh, last week down in Texas. 
And uh, you know what? I got real on that podcast. <clears throat> You'll hear it coming out. The struggles in my life. I was over 300, I was 305 pounds uh, about five years ago. Um, I'm about 75 pounds lighter now. Um, it's not easy. Um, I was getting out of breath tying my shoes. And uh, it's not easy to, to break that habit. Um, food's an addiction, you know. Um, probably battling depression, not realizing it. Um, hating life, stuff in my face. Uh, on top of that, drinking a lot. Um, when you're not happy with yourself and, uh, you know, you're struggling, you tend, to, uh, you tend to lean on the bad things, you know. Eat a lot, drink a lot, do whatever it is, you know. I'm not a drug person, but I know a lot of people smoke a lot of weed. I know a lot of people do other things. Um, luckily, that's never been me. It's not my thing. But uh, I know people do struggle. And it's real. I mean, it need to, needs to be talked about. And you're not in this world to get, uh, alone. You know, we're all doing this together. Um, we all have struggles with relationships. I have, have ma struggles with my marriage. It's uh, Most people uh, know what's going on there. Um, it's not easy. It's not easy. Life's not easy. I got six kids. I had a bunch of real estate investments years ago. Market crashed. Um, lost my shirt on a lot of stuff. But you know what? We keep going. Um, we've all been there. We've all had our struggles. So um, I just think it's important to just be real with the world. Be who you are. Jump on Facebook Live. You know what? People don't like how you look, what you're wearing, what you're saying. You know what? You don't need those people in your life. Um, just be real. Um, my goal is to help people. Um, Again, I've had my struggles in life, still have struggles in life. Um, diagnosed ADHD, it's been something I've been battling my whole life, never even realized what it was. Um, so that's something new for me, uh, self-awareness. Um, I think there's a lot of people out there that struggle with ADHD. Once you uh, study up on it, you realize, wow, that's me. And, uh, you know, there's things I probably have done in my life that um, were ADHD related that have, I know, pissed off my wife. Um, attention deficit, you know comes natural that, you know, I, I look for the shiny object and I lose attention easily uh, to her. She took that personally, that um, I wasn't paying attention to her. Um, and that has definitely caused struggles over the years. But um, as we realize these things in our lives, we realize that, uh, you know, maybe we are battling some depression. Um, maybe we are, you know, addicted to different things. Um, other people are in that journey. Um, again, I'm an open book. If anyone ever wants to reach out and talk, no judgment, I'm here for you. Um, there's some people that have been there for me. Dawn just jumped on, you've been there for me. Benny just jumped on, you've been there for me. <clears throat> Kevin Brady's always there for me. Um, but no, it's uh, a lot of us have had some stuff going on in our lives and we're all the same. Uh, a lot of us just put on a different TV show out front, but behind the scenes, we're all got the same things going on. So um, I just wanna keep it real with everybody. Um, I, I try and share whenever I can, it's not always easy. Uh, obviously, there's uh, some some pain and struggle and some stuff in the past. So, uh, just uh, just want to know, you know, it's not all uh, it's not all flowers and all sunsets and sunrises. And you know, I put a lot of fun pictures up there and fun things I'm doing. But I got my struggles just like everybody else. So, uh, just uh, it makes you feel a little bit better when you know that you're not on this journey alone. Um, down in Texas, like I said, to talk about, there's a lot of people down there that have different things. There's a lot of people that have been overweight. There's a lot of people that have lost everything. There's a lot of people that have been through divorce. There's a lot of people um, that have been in jail. There's a lot of people that have sold drugs, been on drugs. Um, everyone's got a similar story to what you're going through. Your story is not, not unique. And uh, when you open up and start getting real about it, uh, it makes it easier. It makes you realize uh, what you need to do to make it better. Um, keep smiling, Kevin Brady. That's it. We say good morning. We make people smile. We do that. I try and touch everyone in my life. And uh, <clears throat> today, we've touched someone else. Joni showed up. And Janine's, of course, a regular now. And, of course, Father Eugene. Yeah. But uh, Joni has been reaching out to me and uh, talking about joining the crew. And this morning, I came out to a pleasant surprise. Joni was out there in the driveway, so the crew was growing. Uh, we're getting some good reach here, and I love that. Um, you know, I started this kind of as a thing for myself to get myself in shape and uh, now I'm able to help other people get in shape and change their life and get out of bed and to wake up and see stuff like this. I mean, look at that sun. Look at this water. State Park. 10 minute ride from our house. And we lay in bed hitting snooze most of the time. So stop hitting snooze, get out of bed, 
come ride with us. We talk, we share things, we have fun, and uh, we come live and bring a message to you every day. So that said, it's prayer time. Here with Father Eugene. Okay. Thank you. Ryan, thank you. Jenny, thank you, Johnny. We thank God for the gift of this new day, Wednesday, the 21st of uh, July. We are here with our project of uh, We Ride at Dawn. And we pray every day for different intentions. So I would want to pray also today for all campus students and the children who are camping somewhere and they are instructors and coordinators that God will continue to lead them and uh, protect them as they keep the children busy as they continue to teach and then direct our kids and also we pray for the parents as also they make every effort to support and they care for their family and so we pray in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen our hope is in the name of the lord who made heaven and earth Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Almighty God, we thank you for the gift of life. We thank you for the strength and also the companionship. And we pray that as we continue this journey, that you will continue to inspire us, to bless everyone out there today, as also we continue to pray for our campus, for our students, kids, their instructors and coordinators, and we continually pray for all parents today. We pray for, also for our grandparents as we prepare for the first edition of uh, the celebration of grandparents in our diocese. This weekend, we pray that you bless our grandparents, that they may con be continually supported by their families, and they will continually be also a source of inspiration to their children and grandchildren. We pray also for everyone out there as people go out today. We ask for your protection. We ask for your inspiration and success to the works of every of our hands. This is our prayer through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. May the Almighty God bless you, Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you all. All right. Thank you, Father Eugene, as always, for the blessing. That's our Tuesday and Thursday, uh, our Tuesday and Wednesday, Wednesday. special edition. <laughs> and then Janine's trying to walk away without saying anything. <laughs> and we got to put Joni on the spot because that's what we do. <laughs> Say good morning, Joni. Good morning. I didn't know this was part of the deal. This is part of the deal. This is part of the deal. <laughs> He's part this of is part food. of the deal. This right. is we ride at dawn. This is a together thing. It's we. It's more than one person. This was Brian yeah. rides at dawn and the rest of us yeah. tag along. Everyone tags along to Brian rides at dawn. Yeah. <laughs> so, we welcome. Yeah, it's part of the deal. We, we do the prayers we and do our prayers. everyone out there. That's it. Uh, that's it. And then, of that's course, our uh, job. that's our job. We try and touch the world, right? Make yeah. the world a better place, one one ride at dawn at a time. Of course, we got the shirts out. We got uh, yeah. you come you come ride with us. You get a shirt. Yeah. Here it is. We ride at dawn. Know, follow the hashtag. Follow me Instagram, Facebook, all that good stuff. Yeah. Put my messages out. We put pictures out. This initiative That's of it. Shirt. My shirts are uh, going across the country now. I gave some out in Texas, and uh, Todd Freeman just jumped on. He's got one. Mary Ellen is going to ride with me at some point, and she's going to get one. <laughs> Kevin Brady's going to ride with me. He keeps watching, but he's going to ride. Dawn's going to ride. She's still due for a ride. Who else is in here? Benny rides with me every weekend. 
Geraldine, my new Facebook friend. Good morning. Uh, let's see. Who else is on here? You're even getting on to the internet. Kev needs to rent a bike to get a shirt. Yeah, hey, listen, Kev, you're the king of getting shirts. You know how to get shirts. Wait until you get those boxer shorts that uh, Benny's got in the process. We'll, ri we'll ride at dawn and up. Oh, look at that. Here we go. Look at this message that just pops up here. Can you see this? If standing up for yourself burns a bridge, I have matches. We ride at dawn. There you go. Look at how this stuff shows up. Yeah. <laughs> Look at how this stuff shows up at life. We ride at dawn. We ride at dawn. All right, everyone. So we're going to get back on our ride. It's a beautiful morning here. I hope uh, I've inspired you a little bit. Um, keep it real, man. Keep it real. Keep it real. Life isn't easy. We're all struggling. And uh, it's easier when we do it together. So, uh, again, anyone needs anything, um, direct message me, post something in there. Um, my cell phone's out there everywhere. Text me, call me, um, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, anywhere. You just type in Brian Lewis Realtor, I pop up. And uh, I'm happy to, uh, to talk business. I'm happy to talk life. I'm happy to talk marriage. I can tell you what not to do in your marriage. Um, I can tell you what not to do on investment property because I've done it. I've done it the wrong way. I've taken a beating. And uh, I know it only costs a million dollars to get a million dollar education. And uh, I've spent some money on my, my education. Uh, mistakes I've done in life. I've also had a lot of successes. Um, i got six beautiful children. i got a successful real estate business. Um, i got a <clears throat> great team of agents. Uh, Dawn being one of them on here. Um, that we're, uh, we're changing people's lives by uh, helping them find a home in their dreams, helping them to sell their family estates, helping them um, to do whatever it is in their life, real estate related. Um, it's more than just selling properties. It's, uh, it's dealing with people's lives and their histories and their, their futures. And um, we take it seriously. Um, I guess that's why I've been successful out of it because it's, it's more than just selling a structure. It's, uh, it's selling memories and it's selling dreams. Um, so anyway, let's get on a ride. I love you all. Again, I'm here if you need me. Reach out anytime and come ride with me. You'll get a shirt. You'll get some love. You'll get some laughs. And I'll put you on the spot. So you can go live on Facebook too. Be you. Be you. Don't be anyone else. There's only one of you. Go be you. All right, everyone. God bless. Peace out. Have a good one.